I've seen these two go from friends to partners to now husband and wife. And I remember when they first started dating, instantly you could see they were a perfect match. And I could see just how much peace Travis brought to Sherelle's life. And at that moment, I knew we would be here one day. And there was never a doubt in my mind that Travis was the one for her. Cheryl, do you take Travis to be your husband? I do. Do you promise to always love him, trust him, respect him, care for him, and laugh with him? Do you promise to share your life and your dreams with him and to build with him a home that is a place of love, happiness, commitment, and growth? And do you promise to leave that Travis aside in good times and bad, regardless of the obstacles you face with long you love Cheryl? Travis, do you take Cheryl to be your wife? I do. Do you promise to always love her, trust her, respect her, care for her, and laugh with her? I do. Do you promise to share by her, to share your life and your dreams with her, build with her a home that is a place of love, happiness, commitment, and growth? Do you promise to be by her side in good times and bad, regardless of the obstacles you face for as long as you rush out? I do. Spoken the promises for your life together, and you've sealed the vows with the giving or saving of rings. Therefore, it is my honor to say, Travis and Cheryl, that all those in your life get to celebrate as you've already been, forever joined, committed in life and love, but also now as husband and wife. So you may now kiss your bride. It's my incredible honor to introduce you all for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Pastor. Oh!